Welcome to our video on how to make this isometric 3D part. Take a moment to observe the isometric view of the part. Instead, we encourage you to follow along, and analyze the design, as we go through the process of creating it. First we will make horizontal leg. We will remove cylindrical material from it. In second vertical leg, starting from 0 to 60 mm. 10 mm thick. And cylindrical material removal with same radius. 35 mm upside. Let's start design. Select part design workbench. Click here to add a new document. Click here to add a new body. Body is added. Select additive box. Select XY reference plane. Plane is added. Change length. 40 millimeters. Width 50 millimeters. Thickness is 10 millimeters. Click OK. With this reference, cylinder is located at 20 millimeters in X direction and 25 millimeters in Y direction. Radius is 15 millimeters. Select XY reference plane. Move 20 millimeters in X direction. Move 25 millimeters in Y direction. Click OK to remove material. We will add vertical segment. Select XY plane. Check for O length. Add width 50 millimeters. Set height 60 millimeters. Move this segment 10 millimeters backside. In X direction. Click OK to add material with horizontal segment. Select subtractive cylinder to remove material. Change radius. Select reference plane. Rotate this cylinder about Y axis. For upward movement, 10 millimeters plus 25 millimeters. Move this cylinder in Y axis by 25 millimeters. Click OK to remove material. Change this statement to true. This will hide intersecting edges. Select last feature. 
and export this file into STL format. Save this part. Import this part. Select this part and see its properties. Let's move this part in Y direction. And there you have it. By following along, and analyzing the isometric view, you've successfully recreated this part. Well done! Thank you and see you in next video, remember, practice makes perfect.